quartz, granite, quartz, granite. Oh my gosh, it's so confusing. What do I do when I remodel my home? Let me help you out on that. I'll tell you what my decisions were. So this is our rental. So there's a couple aspects when choosing quartz versus granite. Okay, as you can see, this is the granite that we chose. It's textured and they called it leathered. You can feel the design in it. You can do that or you can have the smooth shine. We chose this because with granite, you can take things out of the oven, at least I do, and put it directly on the granite. Now, if you have quartz, the problem with that is that it has a seal and it's gonna leave a stain around. So if I take something hot and put it on here, you're gonna see the burn mark. Same with just a cup of coffee. That happened to my clients. So because it's a rental, I need it to be more functional and less aesthetic. Some people like the aesthetic and they're very careful with their kitchen. But when it comes to a rental, we choose this. Um, and that's the main reason. And the other thing is because this is man-made, the quartz, and it's porous. So imagine you go off to the grocery store and the kids spill the Kool-Aid. If it's not picked up in time or wine, it's going to stain your uh, quartz. So that's another reason that we chose the granite. Um, so it's really a preference thing, functionality or aesthetically pleasing. I mean, I still think that granite is wonderful. I mean, there's three options that you can choose when you're remodeling. Which one is going to pop, right? We chose to do the countertops in granite. Now what you could do is either your cabinets pop or your backsplash pops. And again, in this case, we went pretty basic here, but we let this do all the talking of the kitchen, right? So I hope that you make a really good decision and what's best for you and your family. If you have any questions, always subscribe or click here.